HyperDAP is a new concept that we've been working on for about, what, 10 years? Yeah. And I think it is really all about the, the notion that our shoes should be smarter and should be able to adapt to our activities and to the shape of our feet as they change. So when you open the box, you're gonna have two shoes. You're also gonna have your charger, two pucks, one for each shoe. They magnetically stick to the bottom of the shoes. To check the battery level, you press any button, and the last flash that the LED has, that indicates what your battery level is. If it's full, it, it'll be blue. If it's half full, it'll be yellow. And if it's almost empty, it'll be red. Usually a charge uh, on each shoe will last about over two weeks. Uh, it depends on your use, how, how many times you're tightening and loosening and adjusting throughout the day. This shoe is, is programmed to turn on automatically when you put your heel onto the footbed, so when you slide your foot in and you press your heel down. Ooh. Yep, there's no need to actually turn it on. It, it's just always on. It's smart enough to be ready when you step into it. Like Tinker was saying, automatically runs. The two buttons are marked with just two little blue squares. Um, and the top button, this one, tightens, so you just press the button and the laces will tighten. For to loosen, you just press the back button or loosen button and they loosen. Say you want it to go much tighter, so you just adjust it to where you want it to go. I press and hold both buttons for two seconds and you hear the motor run. That just reset your preset so that every time you get in the shoe now, it'll go to that much tighter setting. There is a loosening button. It's the lower button of the two and you just press it for basically about two seconds and it loosens the shoe up automatically until you can pull your foot out. In case you're having any trouble with it whatsoever, you press and hold both buttons uh, for 10 seconds and you'll see a rainbow of colors go over the lights and that'll let you know that you've reset the system. Your preset won't change, but um, the system will just reset. If that doesn't work, you can throw it on the charger for about 30 seconds and it'll also do a system reset. In the end, it's a multi-purpose sneaker and you should just go have fun and do anything you'd like to do athletically or, or, or casually. We call it 1.0 because it's just the first step in better fit and comfort in an adaptive way that then improves the athlete's performance.